हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू एसएसटी क्लास टेक आउट चैप्टर नंबर सिक्सटीन मीन्स ऑफ ट्रांसपोर्ट विच इज ऑन पेज नंबर हंड्रेड एंड सिक्स सो बिफोर स्टार्टिंग एनी थिंग लेट्स हैव एन ओवर व्यू ऑफ दिस चैप्टर वी नो दैट वी नीड फूड वाटर एंड अ सेफ प्लेस टू लिव From ancient time, man has been in search of food, water, and shelter, for which he used to move from one place to another. In initial stage, man used to walk for basic needs, and then domestication of animals started, and then invention of wheel discovered modern transport system, and led to many inventions in transport. So. In 21st century India has a well developed network of roads railways waterways and airways let's focus on today's objectives to understand about transport and means of transport second to know about various means of transport used in early centuries so before starting with reading of chapter let's have a look on terms related to today's topic so first one is transport means to carry people or goods from one place to another second waterways the slowest and cheapest means of transport that sails on water third roadways means of transport which is at our doorsteps fourth railways means of transport that runs on track fifth airways the fastest and most expensive means of transport let's start reading from book now see the first line from ancient times man has been in search of food water and a safe place to live at first walking was the most dependable mode of transportation so in the first line underline ancient and write old there and in the fourth line underline transportation and we did the meaning of transportation in terms which means to carry people or goods from one place to another so these lines means that from the ancient time only man wanted food water and shelter or a safe place to live and for that he used to move from one place to another by walking as no mean of transport was developed at that time so man used to walk in search of basic needs like food water and shelter move to next line let's start reading then slowly he learned to domesticate animals and ride them for hunting and to move from one place to another so underline domesticate and write paltu right and in the same line underline hunting and write shikar so these lines means that with human development man learned to domesticate animals and animals like horses goats and oxen were domesticated in early stage and they were used for hunting and from moving one place to another right so like today we keep dogs at our homes same like that in the early stages of human development man used to keep horse oxen and goats for hunting and for moving from one place to another look at the sixth line now the invention of the wheel led to the discovery of modern transport system later man invented the chariot combining the horse and the wheel so underline invention and write origin there and in the seventh line underline discovery and write find and underline chariot and its meaning is given combining the horse and the wheel fine so here these lines means that introduction of wheel discovered modern transport system and later with this wheel chariot was developed and chariot means a two wheeled vehicle drawn by a horse you can also see in this picture this is a chariot 
horse and wheel are collectively joined by this right so let's move forward then men went on to search for land which would be safe to live in at this stage he had to cross rivers and streams he hollowed tree trunks and used them to cross rivers and streams which paved the way for waterways gradually the transport system became well developed and led to many inventions in the system of transport so underline hollowed and write cut out there and underline waterways as this is a term and its meaning is the slowest and cheapest means of transport that sails on water so as man was developing and becoming smarter so for that he went to search for land so that he could find a safe place to live and for that he had to cross rivers so he cut out tree trunks and used them for crossing rivers and streams it started means of waterways which means transport through water started right come to the next paragraph india has a well developed network of roads railways waterways and airways and mark roads railways waterways and airways as these are terms of today's topic and we have done the meaning of these in the terms so as we can see transport has well developed and it is still making inventions like metro bullet train etc and india has a well developed system of roads railways waterways and airways and we can see how india is still making inventions in this field so that a transportation could become easy fast and cheap in the coming future so today we did about that how man developed in the field of transportation first he used to walk for moving from one place to another then he domesticated animals then he developed wheel uh, from which he made chariot and then he also used waterways and how india is making development in the fields of roads railways waterways and airways right so now your homework is revise term plus write on copy and reread these paragraphs thank you